Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the release preview channel, which is the build 22,061.1631. This is the latest build for the release preview channel and this build be also released on the May release as the C release or optional update, most likely on the 25th of April, which is the last Tuesday of the month as Microsoft announced last month. In this video, we're going to talk about what is new, what is changed and what is fixed. And of course, if you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech page channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one so let's begin with the video first of all in this update we have a new settings feature if you go into settings and then windows update you'll notice this new option get the latest updates as soon as they're available be among the first to get the latest non-security updates fixes and improvements as they roll out and you can turn this on basically when you turn it on your device will opt in to receive future non-security updates as soon as they're available for commercial customers, the toggle is disabled by default. Also in this update, we have some changes regarding the firewall settings. You can now configure application group rules. Also, Microsoft is introducing the new animated widgets icon. This is a pretty interesting thing that we will also have on the main release. I think it looks pretty nice. We have different animations depending on the weather, of course. I've changed the region now and you can see a different animation now. I think this is pretty cool. And to enable it, it is really simple. You just need to have Vive tools set up on your computer and then open up CMD run it as administrator and then on user account control click on yes and here you're going to have to copy and paste in this command which will enable that and you can just restart your system for the changes to take effect thank you to phantom motion 3 on twitter for discovering this command i also did a previous video in which i showed you how to enable some new widgets options or features inside the latest canary and dev channel builds so i think that is pretty interesting that we also get the animated widgets icon on the release preview channel and also soon enough on the main release also i'm going to mention of few fixes. This update addresses an issue that affects Microsoft Edge IE mode, pop-up windows open in the background instead of the foreground, and also the tab window manager stops responding. These are some fixed issues. Also, this update addresses an issue that displays task view in the wrong area. This occurs when you close a full game by pressing Win plus tab. And basically, these are all the things that are worthy of mentioning in this video. But of course, in the article below, we're going to have the full list of fixes and changes if you want to check it out. But for this video, I thought that these are the things that are worth to be mentioned. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech page channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.